Okay, only on five. Some of the owners accused of abandoning their pets during Hurricane Irma will not face animal abuse charges. Even the owners of pets whose dogs were found tied up during the storm. Contact five investigator Sam Smink is here to explain. Sam. Ashley, the dogs you're looking at. Remember them? We first told you about them during Hurricane Irma. They were left behind to weather the storm. Palm Beach County Animal Care and Control investigators say there are two reasons, though, why they won't or actually can't pursue cases against these pet owners. One, a lack of evidence, and two, a reasonable explanation. They were found roaming the streets, left alone in yards, some even chained up. Animal Care and Control rescued 40 different animals left behind in Hurricane Irma before those hurricane force wind gusts hit. Weeks later, investigators say most of the cases have been dismissed. The vast majority of these animals were found loose in the community. The dog was loose. There's again no way for us to prove that they intended any harm to that animal or that it was loose intentionally. As for the two dogs left tethered, neither owner will be charged. In one case, it was a disabled gentleman that was unable to catch his dog. He left with the animal loose in the neighborhood because he was forced to leave uh, under the mandatory evacuation. And then someone else comes along, an unknown person, and captures the animal and ties it up, thinking they're doing a favor, but then it left the animal tethered. It wasn't his doing. Um, the other case, uh, the investigation showed that the family had evacuated, and there was another family member on their way to come get the dog, but we picked it up prior to that other family arriving to take the dog. Captain David Wileski of Animal Care and Control says they've sent five or six cases to the state attorney's office and are waiting to see when charges will be filed. Back to you. Sam, thank you.